Hey there, history buffs. Today, I'm diving into one of the most turbulent times in economic history. The 1929 economic crash and its impact on the S&P 500. Buckle up because this is going to be a roller coaster through time. So, picture this, it's the Roaring Twenties. The economy is booming and the stock market is on fire. People are investing like there's no tomorrow, but as we know, what goes up must come down. October 29th, 1929. Black Tuesday. The day the stock market crashed, bringing an end to the Roaring Twenties and ushering in the Great Depression. The S&P 500, which had been steadily climbing, took a nosedive. And when I say nosedive, I mean it dropped almost 90% from its peak. Imagine the panic. But what exactly happened? Well, for starters, there was a lot of speculation. People were buying stocks on margin, meaning they borrowed money to invest, hoping the stock prices would keep going up. Spoiler alert, they didn't. When prices started to fall, people rushed to sell their stocks to pay off their debts, creating a cascade effect. Banks were hit hard too. Many had invested heavily in the stock market. When the market crashed, banks started to fail. Imagine losing your life savings overnight. That's what happened to millions of people. The S&P 500, which tracks the performance of 500 large companies listed on stock exchanges in the United States, became a barometer of economic health. And during the Great Depression, it was like watching a patient flatline. Unemployment skyrocketed, factories closed down, people lost their homes. It was a dark time for America, and the world watched as the economic powerhouse crumbled. But history is also about recovery and resilience. It took years, but the economy did bounce back. Programs like the New Deal, introduced by President Franklin D. Roosevelt, aimed to provide relief, recovery and reform. And slowly but surely, the S&P 500 began to recover too. By the late 1950s, the stock market had not only recovered, but was thriving again. The S&P 500 became a symbol of American economic strength and resilience. It showed that while the market can crash, it can also recover and grow stronger. So what can we learn from the 1929 economic crash? For one, it's a stark reminder of the dangers of speculation and the importance of financial regulation. It's also a testament to the resilience of the American economy and its ability to bounce back from even the darkest days. And there you have it, a whirlwind tour through one of the most significant economic events in history and its impact on the S&P 500. If you enjoyed this dive into history, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more fascinating stories from the past. Until next time, keep exploring.